the things that you do and who you are impact you as far as like the social justice movements and the things that have happened? What, what is your point of view of that? At the end of the day, equality is everything. <laughs> Thank you. I mean, <laughs> I was out there just... Did you participate? Did oh, you, yeah. yeah did... I got shot. Really? Yeah, I got shot by a rubber bullet. Please tell me a little bit. How did that make you, f not physically, mentally, how did that make you feel? It made me feel so scared for where we are because I, um, my girlfriend and I, we were going every day and I was, I was going to those protests every single day, you know, just fighting and standing up for, for the voices that aren't, can't be as heard sometimes. And, and what was so scary was like, I wasn't doing anything wrong. <laughs> that, that, that was what was wild. I wasn't, I wasn't throwing things. I wasn't harassing anyone. I was just standing there saying Black Lives Matter and poof, shot me. Wow. And I even got it on video. That was the most wild part. I had, I, had, um, I had my phone out and I was recording the video and, and I saw in the video the cop goes like this and then he shot me. Wow. And it was one of those moments where you realize that like, I, like it's, it's such a weird comparison, but even in the, the people commenting on your pictures and everything from insecurity, it was almost like in that moment that cop couldn't bear what was happening, that, that they were being questioned, that we were using our voices against their actions and ideologies. And do you think maybe he was having a mental breakdown there yeah. himself? Mm -hmm. Because that's the thing. There's two sides of that spectrum. And I think um, on both sides, uh, uh, there's, there's a lot of pain. There's a lot of struggle. There's a lot of hurt. Mm -hmm. And there's a lot of a miss and lack of communication thereof. So then situations like you had to unfortunately go through happen. Um, and did you carry anything? Do you feel like there's any trauma left from that? Is, did it change you in any kind of way um, mentally? I don't know if I have figured that out yet because it's just, it was so surreal, you know? It was just such a scary moment and and just realizing what, what happens to others every day that you don't even have to think about because of privilege and that, that feeling is in itself is really like confusing to sit with and it's, it makes me feel sad. You know, and it makes me just want to keep fighting. I think more than anything, it's not going to make me back down and be like, oh, no, now I'm scared. It's going to make me go even harder because, like, at the end of the day, we're all fighting for each other, you know? Sink or swim, you said to me, do you see me falling?